Hi Poopoos, it's Nessa Poo Queen of Cups Tarot. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so now. Like, share, and subscribe. If you are new here, welcome to the Poopoos Trap. Okay, this is going to be for Virgo, Someone Rising, and Venus on who is coming towards you. Who is popping up on you? Is it a new person, an old person? What love messages they want to tell you before they come towards you? What is their characteristics? Just information on this person, okay? So keep in mind, these are general messages. They may or may not resonate. If they do, great. If they don't, then you can book a personal reading with me. And that information is in the description box below to book on my website to get more in-depth and get more clarification on what you want to know. So you can find out what your own personal story is, okay? The so universe spirits and guys, who is coming towards Virgo for love? Okay. Okay, let me take the ones that flipped over. What is that? Okay, this is a person that you already ended the cycle with. Yeah, definitely. Okay, things have really changed for this, you and this person. This is somebody you already know. We have financial and material changes. We have material harvest. And we have obstacles and challenges. So this is somebody that you ended things with because things wasn't really working out it could have been because one of you guys had problems with your finances um some of you guys could have been very um material focused or just um financially focused and it ended and it probably ended in um not in a good way with obstacles and challenges okay so let's clarify Universe spirits and guys, why is financial and material changes here? Clarify material, financial and material changes. Could be a fire sign, um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Now this person, um, I feel like this person has took charge or um, made changes in their financial world or um took action to make their financial uh situation better this person could have been really financially focused and that's why they probably wasn't they moved away from you and wasn't really giving you the time of day because they wanted to focus on their finances or it could be an air sign a libra gemini aquarius but now this person is all in their head they got anxiety about you but now they want to work on it because somebody has walked away it could be a cancer as well or it could be another earth sign like yourself another virgo another taurus or capricorn Or Capricorn <laughs> like I said um okay this person could have been very obsessive when it came to their finances like it could have been they were just really obsessing o over getting their finances together and they were so much stuck in their head or this could be a person that you had toxic um energy with or just things things with like you just they stop giving. Clarify material harvest. This is somebody you definitely was in a commitment with. With the um, higher friend. Could be a tourist. With the higher friend at the bottom of the deck. Okay, this person is single. I think this person now they got all their financial and they got their stability together yeah now they want to communicate and come back towards you they want to come back towards this commitment this relationship
be a Pisces or a Cancer, but somebody who broke your heart and now want to give give back to this situation again and bring an offer. But things, they kept a lot of things hidden from you. They didn't really tell you um, why they're walking away or why things aren't working. But the truth was because of their financial situation. Yeah, there's somebody from your past with the Six of Cups. Yep, here it is again. Eight of Wands, this person wants to run, rush back towards you. They want to communicate. And I feel like they want to tell you everything that was hidden on why this didn't work or why they walked away from you. Because somebody walked away because I seen the Eight of Cups. Clarify ob uh, obstacles and challenges. Okay, this is somebody who's really, really happy. Okay, could be a Sagittarius as well. Um, it was a lot of de okay, it was some deception. So it could have been some toxic inf I mean, toxic information. You could have re received some toxic information from this person or about this person. But it could have been some toxic times that you had with this person because we got the Seven of Swords. This person is being very, very patient to even come towards you, or this person could be patient on even trying to sneak back towards you. Could be a Leo as well, but this person really made you happy. Or you made them happy. somebody you was married with or you had a family with could be a Pisces so yeah with the four wands this person also could have been possibly married as well yeah this person is still stuck this person still stuck so what other messages yeah it ended with this person you ended this with this person with the coffee card so what other information, what other messages do you have about this person that's coming to us, Virgo, for love? This person has changed. They won't change in um, your relationship now. Some of you guys, um, yeah, they could have had another. They could have had a um, a breakthrough. They could have had a new cycle that had begin begun from for them, and they changed because pathway is at the bottom of the deck. Well, they won't change, and um, this with you yeah this person's in love with you <laughs> with the love of scar this person could possibly want to marry you now with courthouse mm -hmm. yeah this is somebody you were with already let's see if I can get some more messages out of here okay so this person definitely was it could have been some toxic things that um definitely happened with bad health but i told you this person now things have changed with their finances and now they want to come back towards you because we have unexpected income and um great fortune 
So what love messages do they want to tell Virgo before they come back towards them? retreat this person could possibly want to even take a vacation with you or want to take you somewhere on a vacation because we have retreat it's time to it's time to disconnect from the world Flipping everywhere. So this is your this this person is your true love though. But it's a love yourself first at the bottom of the deck. So it's a true love. This is a romance of a lifetime. So this person is definitely your true love. I feel like this person is your soulmate as well. I just got that message in, in that message intuitively. Sorry. So let's see what other messages they have for this person. What other messages do you have about this person that's coming to us, Virgo? Or what signs could be in their chart so they could be aware? They could have Capricorn in their chart. They could have Virgo in their chart. They could have Scorpio in their chart. So we have Sun in Capricorn, number 10, um, status, work diligently towards your goals. So this part, that's what this person was doing. They was trying to work towards their goals, and now they have a huge change, change of heart towards you now. So we have Moon in Scorpio, number 20, transformation. What did I tell y'all? They could have had an awakening, a change in your emotional life. That's what's going on with this person. So I'm just telling you. So, what other messages do you have for Virgo about this person that's coming towards them? We have compromise at the bottom of the deck. We have opportunity and this situation will improve. So some of you guys may give this person another chance because they have an opportunity to come back towards you to um, make this situation right and a compromise with you. Forgiveness guys might need to forgive this person or you're going to forgive this person so this person is definitely going to be taking action because we have to take action here this person is looking for any sign to see if they can come back towards you to see if you are going to give them another chance so we look for a sign in the near future so you guys definitely may be getting back with this person or giving this person another chance with these messages so let's see what your advice is to do on about this person coming towards you. Uh oh. Some of my heart. So what advice do you have for Virgo when it comes to this person that is coming towards them for love? Get one card for you for your advice. Nice 
please. Thank you. Yeah, you're gonna give this person another chance. <laughs> you and this person is, is going, could possibly be ending back up with each other. So it says, ceremonies and celebrations. It's a time of important life passages such as weddings, birthdays, graduations, or anniversaries. So, like I said, some of y'all, this person could be coming back towards you to even talk, be talking about marriage now. Okay. So that is all the messages that I have for you guys. I love you guys oh so much. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. If it resonated, drop comments down in the comment section. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me, that information is in the description box down below to book a reading on my website. Don't forget to hit the notification bell to get notifications on when I upload new videos. Okay. So... Hope you guys come back to visit again. That's all I have for you guys. Love you guys. Bye, poo-poos.